Hello guys, Liam here, and today we're back in the Let's Play, finally. It has been a long while since we've been on the Let's Play. Or at least since we've recorded on the Let's Play, I've been playing. Kind of. Off and on. The reason I'm not playing right now is... Oh man, um, what to get rid of. The reason I haven't been playing is because Feed the or I have been, I have, I am playing right now because Feed the Beast is down. And that's because we need a new server host, so we're working on that. Uh, it should be fixed up real soon. Uh, it goes there, what else? Uh, I've basically just been mining, that's why you haven't seen many episodes. Oh, one. Okay. Yeah, I've basically just been mining, so sorry for the lack of episodes. Um, I'll leave you. What else? I think we're good. Oh, I have. I got this on me. Boom. What else? What else needs to be placed somewhere? Uh, you do, and I don't think I see anything else. This gold can probably go there. Yeah, no, that's all I see. But I figured you guys would want to see what I've been doing. And, well, it's just been mining, but I found a lot of mob spawners. And I see this mine that we have here. I've basically abandoned that. I plan on filling the whole thing eventually. But that's a job for a whole nother time. What I've really been up to is let's grab our boat that we found. I've been mining over off on this island, if anyone remembers this island way over here. Look how pretty this is. That's just pretty. That's pretty generation. Can I just throw it out there? And then, I've basically been mining off on this island. I found a, uh, whatchamacallit, the abandoned mine shaft. And I found this mine that is so, so big. Like, imagine Ethos Lab's mine, or his base, if you've seen his cave. Oh no, oh no, oh no. If you've seen his base cave thing, it's like three times the size of that. And this, I felt really stupid, but I was walking by here one day, and this is just a spider spawner that's just luckily right here. So well, we will possibly do something with that. For now, it's going to sit there empty because I have no use for it. Because I, because of this abandoned mine shaft, I have uh, cave spider spawners, and I found... A spot where there's two cave spider spawners within the same area so I can make a double spider spawner which I will definitely be doing we need string for who knows what but we need it oh yeah we need it for trip wires and making wool so that kind of thing um, basically that's it I really wanted to find a skeleton spawner but I haven't I found oh no Wow well this is my mind but um I found a skeleton spawner that... No, I didn't find a skeleton. I found two zombies. And I... Two zombie spawners, but I really want a skeleton spawner. I can't really talk today very well. If you haven't been able to tell. But as you saw, it was kind of annoying to get over to this island. I had to take a boat ride. So something I think we might want to do is make a road over here. Maybe not... It's either going to be a railroad that is just on the edge of the... Uh, ocean bottom of the ocean so we can still see out I think that looked really cool and this is the mine if we want to check it out a little bit this is where it starts this is how I found it and oh if you saw I have 30 diamonds now which is so cool I can actually start making diamond stuff but probably see here's one of the spawners there's another spawner way deep in there and then the cave spider spawner is over there there's actually three over there but one of them I haven't conquered yet, and I don't think it's in, no, I don't think it's going to happen, but this is, this is just the beginning of the cave, and this should just alert you to how big this is, it's so big, but I think this is actually where we're going to want to have our road come out, and we can use this whole cave, this whole big open room, to make it look really pretty, we can have a lot going on in here, chest, because this is going to be the mining island, I don't want to mine underneath my island anymore. 
because it's ugly and I might want to do stuff underneath my island. So, this is where we're going to want to be going. I think we're going to go with the railroad. We could do the Eats Road thing with boats, but it's not like it's complicated, but I just don't like boats in general. So, I think we're going to go with minecarts because they just look nicer. They're more clean. Oh, I have rails on me. Ah, I should put those back. Uh, let's write down the chords to this spot, though. Um, nah, 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 18, 24, 501. So this is about where we're going to want to have our rail come out. So I think I'm going to do a little work on that. I don't. I didn't bring a very good pick because I was talking to you guys. But uh, I'm going to do work on that, and I'll get back to you guys once I've done that. So see you then. Hello guys, we are back, and I've been working a little bit on the tube system. That's what we're going to be calling it, it is the tube. And don't worry, that won't be the only one. We'll have lots of tubes running all throughout the ocean around our base. Lighting, I still need to work on it. I'm not sure if I want it to be dark, or if I want it to be kind of lit. But right now it looks pretty cool, but we'll see. It That's as far as it goes, it starts right there, and it goes whoop. And then it just stops right where you see it. Because <laughs> working underwater is painfully... It's painful. That's the best way to put it. Especially when you don't have any Aquafinity helmet. And the one thing that really has helped, though, is I was playing around with my Optifine settings. Or actually, I got Optifine. And uh, apparently it comes with clear water. I, at first, I thought it was a lot cheaty. But I, I tried to turn it off and I couldn't, so I just played with it. <laughs> so, it really does help, and the main reason I got Optifine is because, one, it boosts my FPS, because if you can't tell, I don't get very amazing FPS. Let's look. Yeah, I'm getting 28 frames right now, which is good. I usually, when recording on vanilla, I'll get like 12, and that's just awful. It looks, it's bad video quality, but the main reason I wanted Optifine, or the second main reason, is because it combines the glass, so the glass looks really nice. And this is kind of how the tunnel works. We're going to have a railway through here, and it's our tube. You can see the island really nicely. Right now it's just torchlit. Excuse me, torchlit. And this is about the extent of how far it goes. It looks really cool. Um, when we get more deep into here, because if we look at the coordinates right now, our uh, Z is 383, and we're going to 500. So we'll probably have it open up into a cool mine thing and make it look like a mine in here, so our tube will have interesting things for us to look at. When we're coming through here, we'll have a really pretty view of our island. And it's a pretty view. Uh, glass is hard to get. I've been raiding over there and over there. I'm trying to... Um, I don't want to see any other islands from our island. So that's one thing. Uh, this is really as far as I've gotten. It is hard work. It's a lot of digging. It's a lot of enchanting. It's a lot of everything really and this is all has been and it's it takes a while too it's not like I have TNT or anything like that so that's all I've really got to do so I just dig and I dig and I dig all day long but for now I think we're gonna this is as far as much as I want to do for this episode because it's been more than one day for me it's been a couple but I haven't been playing constantly Anyways, um, I think we want to go do something else right now. Or maybe... Mm, I th maybe want to try working on... One thing I did want to try while you're here. Um, I want to see if adding a second layer of glass makes it look better at all. So we can try that out. Where's my little spot? Do, 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 do. It's my way out. I need to make a little breathing spot too. If you're working underwater, something that's very helpful is doing this, bringing torches, and going like that. And then you can breathe again, which is very nice. Okay, so let's just... That much. That's all we really want to do. Let's go see if that does anything. Um, Not really, it's just a waste of glass. I wanted to see. If someone likes it, you can let me know, but... It's not going to change a whole bunch for me. Oh, it's too far away. Whoop. 
Oh, see, this is the hard part. When you miss with glass underwater, it's really painful to get rid of. But that is definitely something that helps. So if you are going to do any underwater builds, I would su definitely suggest doing that. And possibly this clear water is also very helpful. That's me. Okay, there. Do ding. So I think that's all that the roof needs. It's just going to be glass. It'll look. I think that'll look pretty cool. We need definitely a different way of lighting, for sure because this way is not working for me. The way the rails are going to go is um, we're going to have them and they're going to go like this in here. And they'll go Woo -doo -doo, and there'll be a lot of spinny spin like this and then this way will come in here. And this whole track in here will be uh, booster rails or most of it will be booster rails so we can go we could shoot through here and we should be able to go pretty fast because we cannot have booster rails in this area. And then we'll have this little stop here for more booster rails to keep our speed up. And then we keep going. That's the idea behind how the shape is going. So maybe I'll start. Uh, I want a skin. I definitely don't want this sand here. We need to pick something. What? Hmm. Okay, that's too slow. Yeah. There we go. Um, what, what could we use? What could we use? What do I have on me? Uh, not cobble. What could we use? Um, do we want to keep a stone? No. I think maybe stone bricks is probably what we'll go with. Because that looks structured and we want it to look like it's holding back the water. So, I think stone bricks is what I'll go with. Uh, I'm going to have to cook up a bunch of uh, cobble. Yeah, I'm gonna go cook up some cobble, and I'll get back to you guys, and we can check out what we like. Okay, we're back. I cooked up some uh, stone. That's what the stone brick looks like in here. So, that's an idea. I made this little pattern up. I don't know if I love that. And then, I was thinking something. Hang on, let's grab some of this. Uh, where are you? Spruce? It's hard to find that spruce, let me just say. Um, maybe something like this, or possibly, uh, leaves instead, but I'm kind of, uh, this looks okay, actually, this is kind of a funky pattern, maybe that, I don't know, I, I'm thinking that's one of my favorites, we might want to try leaves, but I don't have shears, so I'm too lazy to go get it, but these are, I didn't really particularly like this one, but between these two, they don't look too good together, I already did try that, but one of these two. I think we might go with this, maybe a different pattern, but something similar to that. So, let me know what you think. Uh, thanks for watching, and have a great day, guys. Thanks, bye.